You okay, buddy? Yeah, this is done and I'm ready for the day. Storm Pier. I've got a bone to pick with you. It was so windy last night. Rufus kept waking up and pacing up and down because he was scared of the wind. I kept waking up because I was scared of the wind. And then because the wind was pressing up, because the wind kept pressing up, and because the wind kept pressing us up against the bank, it kept making the fender squeak right next to our bedrooms so all night. It just sounded like we were on this really creaky old shit. And every so often there would be a massive gust and it would literally bang us into the side. At one point we both shot up like, <gasps> looked out the window <laughs> thinking someone was like on the boat, but it was just the wind. So we're a bit tired today, but luckily it's actually going to be a chilled day today. Yay! That was a nice one. I've met loads of lovely people. Go on then. Yeah. Watching myself eat cookies made me want to eat a cookie. I'm going to have a big one. Whoa. Good morning. Good morning. Okay. See ya. Do you want to go find a sandwich? One then. Yeah. Well, his sister Greer recommended this to us, and it's the Vicks First Defense Spray. And you basically, if you feel like you might get ill, like if you've got the little signs of it coming, you spray it up your nose. And it actually seems to work, doesn't it? <laughs> it's really good, but you have to catch it the second you feel a slight like... Ooh. If you catch it when the symptoms have already developed, then it's too late for you, I'm afraid. But because we were on the tube yesterday and we were kind of at Winter Wonderland, we've both had a, a little squirt. So hopefully we won't get poorly. I think a lot of it is just being tired as well, isn't it? Yeah, we're quite tired. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out this vlogmas thing is quite a lot of work. <laughs> it is, and it's mainly the storm. It was that was hard. Yeah, not being able to sleep is the main thing. Come on, stop doing your movie thing. <laughs> that was the nice chill day going. Amy. We were literally just about to head out for a nice chill day and I've realised that there's a laundrette nearby and <laughs> we're on our last pair of pants each. So we need to go and obviously Christmas Eve is tomorrow and we really need some pants. So rather than just having a nice chill day in the town, we're taking our laundry <laughs> with us. Maybe hey, are you wearing Chucky's outfit? Am I? I don't know. I don't know the film very well. I think I am. Kind of. Chucky's got multiple colours. Oh, okay. But, yes. Warning, Chucky warning. Okay, yeah. You're good. <laughs> <laughs> it's close, though. <laughs> My hair's red as well. It's a good job it's not still orange. It's not a difference. Mm. <laughs> I'm joking. Wow, what did you show? <gasps> Jacob, I'm joking, I'm You look lovely. Let's go into town. Ah, uh, lovely shopping day. <laughs> Careful. Ah. <laughs> uh. Don't you just love living on a boat? Yes. To the town. Just a bit further up the towpath. It's not mega muddy. Nowhere near as much as where it was, but it's definitely muddier. So, so happy with our spot. It's still really busy up here though.
these washing machines are really good because they're really big. We've not brought that much because they're not normally this size. Nice, got the washing on, half an hour to kill, but we're on the wrong side of town to do any of the shopping. We might see if there's a little bite to eat somewhere. Oh yes. That's a good one, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Little hot is done. Let's go get our washing. Carry it around town with us for the next hour. <laughs> Literally just walk back in. Look at that timing. <laughs> Do you want your t-shirt, my friend? <laughs> it's a bit wet. <laughs> Ready Let's... for some shopping. <laughs> Let's go into town. <laughs> There's a few market stalls in town again today, so we're going to take our washing to have a little look at them. It's really heavy though because they're not dry, <laughs> so I'm carrying around all the water as well. <laughs> we always get one of these and it's boring, but it's the only time we ever actually use calendars. It's exactly this format. I think this one's easier to store. 10 meters. How much is it? I don't know. Amy's turn to put in a shift. We're well, the biggest burden that's weighing us down. We went back to that cafe that had the really good sandwich and we've been talking about it all day. <laughs> we've been so excited. But they'd sold out and they said that they were just really popular, so we can't have them. She's already having to readjust, she's carried it from over there. Alright! <laughs> Alright, swapping back, Amy's made it just down that little jitty. <laughs> we did it! <sighs> We can have clean pants. <laughs> Just had a guy admiring our gingerbread house. We got a compliment on our gingerbread house. <laughs> What's next on the chilled day list? Right, we've scrapped chilled day. It's not a chilled day today. It's a prep for Christmas day. So we have just bought... It's up here, that. We just bought a big jug of water and we don't buy like water from the shops but we wanted the bottle and we couldn't find any in the recycling. We want to catch some of our engine drippage. So we're going to pour that in the water tank and our spare two, two litre big jerry can. I think it's a bit more than two litres lad. Our big one. <laughs> then we can have more water and tidy up the stern a bit because you know, we want to be tidy for Christmas. Yeah. Thank One you. of our duckies has fallen in the water. Oh no! <laughs> and someone's plastic it back. Careful! Yeah. Ducky. Ducky guy! That must have been the storm. The other one's there, isn't it? Yeah. Phew! This is where we keep our water underneath dudes. Which isn't ideal, but we keep it pretty clean because we've got this layer and then this layer. And then give it a little sweep. This is all rust, which isn't ideal. We use this special key. Undo it. And then the hose usually goes in there. We're going to do this. And before someone comments, is this rated for water. No. <laughs> it's not. Ta-da! Could definitely pour it, but I don't want to risk getting yeah. water everywhere. Slow and steady. There we go. Yay. 
once you've got the jiggle right the siphon just sucks it all down in there one engine bay bottle with handle next all right you ready Ooh. you good yeah Right, we're going to close this up then. Okay. This is our backup tank. Like emergency water. Ta-da! Dupes, don't go near the hole, please. Bit more water in the water tank. All right, it's my turn for the no longer chilled day and instead get ready for Christmas day. Well, it kind of isn't, it's just more boat maintenance. I'm going to go clean out some of the water in the bilges because we like to do that every once in a while and after our previous mooring, there's so much mud clogging the drains and it's getting quite wet in there. So I'm going to go clean it out. Oh, lovely, lovely engine bay. In the winter, and mainly from our last spot, all the mud and stuff gets clogged up in here. And then when it rains, the water will run down into the drains, and then before it can drain out, it will flood into here. So yeah, these are supposed to be drained, so any water that goes on the stern should go down here and trickle out of a little hole. But when it gets too muddy and dirty, those holes get blocked and then the water just ends up in there. That's one of the big downsides of having a cruiser stern. Your engine bay almost always has got rainwater in the bottom, which yeah, makes yeah. it very hard to know whether you've got a leak or not. <laughs> Wes is going to pump out all the rainwater and I am going to go... and stand in the bathroom to the far right as I can on the boat because then it makes all the water go and you can suck it out easier. Tell me when! Tell me when I can leave! Nice. It's mainly just water. Just rainwater, just isn't it? Just dirty, yeah. Not too much of it, isn't it? Look at all the mud. <laughs> So here's the before, completely clogged up mud, here's the after! It doesn't look that good, but it's functioning much better. The water flows and that's all that matters. Looking much better. Yeah. All done. Now just soaking up the last bit of water with the nappies. Lovely. I'm going inside now because it's cold. <laughs> Well, also because you've got another annoying job to do. Bye. <laughs> Don't be long. It's time to hang up all the laundry. Just got this bit of string that runs behind the stove and the heat from the stove rises up and dries them really quickly. Oh, they smell really clean. Christmas decorations <laughs> or sock drying. How's it going? I mean, it's not great, but it's better. Should I shine the torch? Hang on. Wow, no water at all. Definitely needs like a good scrub or something there. Yeah, just the, like, that little layer of rust, but it's reassuring. Yeah, a lot of it as well is just caked on dirt. Like it doesn't look like a lot of it is rust. It just needs, um, just needs like just scratching all that dirt off. I think a lot of it was that like, more in there. Mm. There was so much just mud. And then we need to do this middle bit as well. Yeah. Right, come on in then. It looks amazing. 
these are the hands of someone who's had a very chilled day. <laughs> well done. Oh. Honey, I'm home. <laughs> right, come on, hands in. It's all of my arms as well. Well, I'm going to have to paint my nails again because I'm not getting this dirt out anytime soon. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Let me check because you're rubbish at washing your hands. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get enough practice. Let me check. Mm-hmm. Just don't look at the nails. Look, I can't get that on. That's just who I am now. Oh well, at least we've got the nice soothing sounds of the engine running after all that. We're going out in an hour. <sighs> These are from my mum. Oh. oh, right. We are going out in about 49 minutes. Um, but it's one of those days where we've sort of forgotten to eat. I think it's because we had our heart set so much on that sandwich. They're sandwiches! <laughs> so we haven't eaten today, so we're gonna try and eat something before we go out, because otherwise we're just gonna spend loads on chips. And while Amy's sorting that out, I'm gonna try and get a bit more editing done, because I feel like tomorrow's gonna be quite a busy day. Done a little bit of today's editing. Amy's wrestling with the gingerbread house while trying to cook dinner because we need to leave the boat in 15 minutes and there's no room for anything. <laughs> I messaged Bear saying we're going to be late again. Sorry Bear, we're literally always late when we meet them. It's quite funny though editing footage from earlier because we said this at the start of the day. It's actually going to be a short day today. <laughs> Of course, it wasn't going to be. <laughs> oh. Amy's just whipped up a quick pasta and chicken tomato thing. Looks good. Cheese tomato pasta. Nice. Thank you, Chef. Yes, Chef. No! <laughs> Man down. I just stood on it. It's part of the hedgerow. Oh, I thought it was the wreath. No, the wreath's still on don't there. just put it back on there. Oh, don't act like that's sanitary at all. Wait, we're still missing part of the hedgerow. Come on, I haven't got time. This is a priority one. Is it? Just don't eat the hedgerow. Foot. Don't eat the hedgerow. Right, we need to eat this fast and get ready. So we're going to do a cool transition. Whoa. I don't remember what I was doing. Transition complete. What are we doing? Let's go to the pub! <laughs> That's quite ambitious, isn't it? It said the 21 flip could never be done. Split! Split! Oh, oh. That was pathetic. That was even worse than yours! Oh, goodness. They were right. Go on, Andy. Oh, now I can't. What, try and turn these over? The pressure. Are you... <laughs> <laughs> I can't hold it properly. Yeah, that's what I've seen. I've done two. I'll do next, Ready? Tip! Yeah! Oh, that's good. Yeah. 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 I'll just do it the old, boring way. The old fashioned. Tried and tested. And tested. Drink and banana grams done. Now it's back to the boats. For the more advanced games. <laughs> <laughs> Quick stock rotate. <laughs> the socks that have dried while we're out get removed and then they get pushed up and then these get moved from there to there so they're closer to the fire. One thing Amy <laughs> really gets into is stock rotating the washing when it's drying. I love me a system. She'll get up at like 3am because she can't stop thinking about the stock rotation and just get up and just start moving the washing around. Don't get me wrong, I very much appreciate it, it's very useful. Just quite entertaining <laughs> to observe. I just love a system. It's not a games night without some snacks, so we're going to take these, some of these, thank you so much Michael, some of these and some crisps. Time for the long canoe over to game night.
Oh, I'm, I'm good. This is Andy and Steve's adorable Christmas set dressing. Oh, who's this guy? <laughs> <laughs> We're having our Christmas game night. Oh. Okay, this is how you do a Christmas cracker. Okay. Ready? Yay! Yay! I win a slightly small, too, too small hat. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Yay! You got oh, it's on the floor. Yay! <laughs> Will it fit? Slim fit hat. Oh, not oh, too bad. No, oh, no. not bad. Don't push it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Alright, go on then, Amy. Let's hear your joke. <clears throat> if it's your walkers one, I'm going to be furious. What falls at the North Pole and never gets hurt? Snow! Snow! <laughs> <laughs> what do you call a man who claps at Christmas? What? Oh. Santa Claus. Yeah! Oh, well <laughs> We're going to open this early. Amy, Wes, and the Bears have fun together. Merry Christmas. Look from Shawnee and Jess. Oh, thank you. Shall we open it? Open it. Let's all claw at it like a horde of zombies. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Traitor's card game! We love the traitors! Nice! Thank you! <laughs> yeah! Yay! That's such a good game, apparently. I've never played it properly, but they really like it. <laughs> Thank you! Thank you very much! Oh, so, we can play the chase. Rail Race, which is the game that might not be very good because we thought it was a different game, but it's not that game. <laughs> Monopoly Deal. The Traitor's Card Game. Ooh. And then the Classics. The, classic. the game mm. Bananagrams. So we've already had a couple of what warm a up Bananagrams. Game one, selected. Oh, in the middle. At the premiere of Four Weddings and a Funeral, who wore a dress held together by a giant safety pin? Ah. Uh... Kate Winslet. No. Liz Hurley. Michelangelo's fresco of the creation of Adam is in what building? The uh, Sistine Chapel. <gasps> yes. Who had hits with Smooth Criminal and You Are Not Alone? Uh, Michael Jackson. Yes. <laughs> TV <laughs> MasterChef is judged by John Trode and who else? Greg Wallace. Yes. Um, adios is a form of farewell in what language? Italian? No, Spanish. How should the Queen be addressed on first introduction? Royal Highness. Your Majesty. Oh. Um, Robert Patterson plays Edward Cullen in what film Twilight. series? Yes. What is the main colour of Everton's home shirt? Uh, blue. Yes. What six-letter word means unreasonable fear? Phobia. Where on the body is the funny bone? Elbow. Correct. In the Industrial Revolution began in what century? 18th. Correct. Go big or go home. No, I'm <laughs> sticking with my 3,000. My humble 3,000. Thank you. Okay, I earned 4,000. The Chaser is offering me 1,900 to go down one, or 10,000 to go up one. <laughs> Mm. That's quite a good you offer. only got four. That's quite genuine. Even though I've literally just mocked you for I'm gonna say. I'm gonna say who's red. Is it A cucumber? B lettuce or C tomato? Amy, would you like one, two, or three? Three. Which Russian composer oh. wrote the music for the Nutcracker Ballet? Was it A. Stravinsky? B. Prokofiev, or C, Tchaikovsky. Do you know it, Andrew? Oh! C. Hey, was going for C, Tchaikovsky. That's correct! Yay! Yay! That's what I do! <laughs> Tracer has also put C, Tchaikovsky. Oh, she's oh. coming for me, though. She's coming for me. Well done. The governess is staring me in the eyes. 
Here we go, I need to get this right. Who once said that cauliflower is nothing but cabbage with a college education? Was it A, Rudyard Kipling, B, Oscar Wilde, or C, Mark Twain? <laughs> <laughs> Who were any of those people? <laughs> B, Oscar Wilde. <laughs> Oh. The answer was C, Mark Twain. Did she get it right? Did Governess get it right? Oh. Governess got it wrong. Oh. 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 Skinny your teeth. Was very tense. Was it A, diet of worms? B, dish of snails? Or C, diner of bugs? Easy. <laughs> <laughs> to escape. C, Diner of Bugs. It was A. No. Oh. Did the beast get it right? The beast got it right. Oh. Oh. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> no. 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 The player that's out. Consult the rules. If the chaser snacks. answers enough questions correctly to land on the same space as their colour coded contestant playing piece, then that contestant is out of the game. Mm. Sorry, Stephen. It's even sad. I'll just tidy up the numbers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get more snacks. Get more nibbles. The final chase. Bring it on. Is on. Oh, I've already read that one before. In the, Sim <laughs> in the Simpsons, what are Homer's favourite cakes? Donuts. Correct. How many numbers form a bank sort code? Six. Correct. In the saying, Rome wasn't built in a what? Day. Correct. What noise can be made by a happy cat in a car engine? A purr. Correct. <laughs> Player is a Spanish word for what part of a holiday resort? A beach. Correct. In 2011, Talk That Talk was a number one album for who? Uh, Abba. <laughs> Incorrect. Rihanna. What happened? Nothing. Nothing. Carry on. In poker, how many cards are there in a full house? Ooh. Five. Correct. Who played Mark Larkin in the TV series The Darling Buds of May? Oh, I do know this. Pam Ferris. Correct. Ooh. 17. Andy got 17. <laughs> that was impressive. Well done. No, that's... Rail race is next. The game we accidentally bought. In the event of a six being thrown, an instant card is taken from the top pack and the directions or qualifications thereon have to be followed by the player. <laughs> The card must be taken before the player moves, but unless specifically directed, the conditions need not be followed immediately. I, if a certain town is to be visited, this can be done with the mo when the most opportune for the player. Sounds like it's an antique show. Yeah, sure. Come on, chaps. <laughs> Off we go. Player, should a player decide to delay the playing, playing the card, it should be placed face up along his... his... <coughs> Sorry, you're not allowed to play anymore. Root <laughs> cards. When the instructions are completed, it should be replaced at the bottom of the pack. Should two or more trains be on the same line, the rearmost trains may only overtake and pass it to town. Nope. Scrap that. I'm out. It's silly. It's a terrible game. Stop that. We it's don't like silly. it. <laughs> the only thing that was good about it was the teeny tiny dice. Oh, no. Sorry, teeny tiny dice. Not today. I'm a nickel. Sorry, rail race. Train. You're too confusing and just make the text a bit bigger. <laughs> and the I've... game a bit better. I thought they were cars. <laughs> Like they do look like that. Oh. It's a no from us. Rail race has been relegated to the floor. We're playing the traces now. Are we all happy that they're shuffled? I really don't yes. want to be the traitor. Pick one. Your fate. Don't show anyone or don't react. The audience at home knows mine. Oh, you then eat it. <laughs> Burn the evidence. Press event. Okay. And something happens on the screen. Amy, why does your card say traitor? Go away. <laughs> <laughs> That's been a murder. <laughs> That's okay. been a murder. Take turns to secretly press a button on screen. If you are a traitor, press the number of players you wish to murder. That's the number of players you want to murder. Wesley! The number of players you want to murder. And then done to confirm it. Three. I... <laughs> Wesley's murdering one of us because he's the traitor. Hey, hey, hey. 
You have to press dawn. Right, pass the device to <gasps> the traitor. You chose. <laughs> <laughs> you have selected murder, play three. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Just press the number, come on. Oh, that's where the numbers were, where she just tapped. Fast device to next player. Screen clock wise. <laughs> who you gonna murder? Murder reveal. Reveal who you've murdered. Wait, 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 before you do it. One moment, let's just consult go- the rules. We're gonna be- <laughs> Right. Mm. <laughs> and he's acting suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> That's suspicious if you ask me. <laughs> Just press it. <laughs> Crashed. Andy's murdered you. Steve's murdered you. I'm looking at you all in the eyes. <laughs> Someone's murdered you. It's been a murder. Hey! Oh, Mr. Henderson. What happens now? I'm seeing if I've got a shield and I don't. <gasps> so I'm dead. Death. Was I faithful or was I a traitor? We have to be. Because no, you're dead. You can murder another traitor. Oh, that's suspicious, Wesley. Mm. Didn't you know that? Didn't you know that? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you know that on the first time we played? Interesting. I was... was... <laughs> Faithful! <gasps> oh, what have you done that for, someone? This is not right. We can't get rid of so the Faithful. Bring it round us. Because I'm dead. I can't fix that dead. It's banishment. Here we go. A minute to accuse okay. each other. I've got absolutely no clue. My only slight <laughs> clue is when Andy pretended to be a vampire. <laughs> <laughs> that was quite it's suspicious. Like in plain sight. <laughs> Just wait for someone. No, no. That's oh, me! That is you, Wes. Wes! Do I have to do it as well? Oh! Okay. Reveal Those vote. have to stick together. <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh! You'll see. You'll see. <laughs> but I stand up there and it says faithful. <laughs> another one gone. <laughs> Ooh. What? Two votes to what? I voted for Andy. How very gay. Because when Steve accused me, Andy does a little smirk. Because he just got away with it. <laughs> Told you right from the start. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I am a faithful. What <gasps> does that mean? That means. That means. The vampire all along the way. The clues are right in front of us. <laughs> I am dead. You played it so well. <laughs> With any little evil well, they face. Just spell someone's n- loads of spelling <laughs> yeah. and then wrong. I voted for Andy because me and Wes were very passionate about the shield, which implies we both desperately need it. So I voted for Andy. Andy was sat there laid back. Okay. Good work, Amy. Well done. Well done, babe. That was difficult. Well, this time, you got it wrong because I am. Oh! <gasps> <gasps> How did you? Why were you so passionate about the shield? To throw you. To throw you a red herring. 
No! <laughs> I think it was Steve. I just want to say, <laughs> I ain't taking the money. <laughs> Andy is the winner. Well done, Andy. Woo! Yes. Taking home a solid 55 gold. 55 Ooh. gold. Well done. Oh, You're rich. Well, I'll spend it on. <laughs> Merry, Merry, Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas Eve. <laughs>